The first step to identifying and fixing a device fault is to capture the event of interest and to root cause the issue. The 2 Series MSO provides several advanced triggers that help you capture complex events. The signal we are capturing on the instrument here is a train of pulses that has a randomly occurring half height run. We can quickly set up a run trigger by choosing run for the trigger type. Adjusting the upper and lower thresholds to help us quickly capture the run signal. There are other advanced triggers also available. Pulse width, timeout, setup and hold, rise fall, and logic trigger. We can quickly set up a search definition to see if there are other runs like the one we triggered on within the acquired waveform. The results of the search are shown on the search badge and we can see that there are several runs in the acquisition. After stopping the acquisition, we can navigate to each occurrence using the navigation controls on the search badge. The search results can also be viewed in a tabular format by enabling the results table. Low-speed serial buses are common in embedded designs. The 2 Series MSO supports protocol decode and triggering of the most popular serial buses, such as I2C, SPI, UART, CAN, LIN, and SEND. Let's look at an I2C protocol decode. The decode shows up as a new bus waveform that's aligned with the analog waveform, making it easy to verify the values being written as well as to view the corresponding analog waveform. The results can be viewed in a tabular format by enabling the results table. You can easily trigger on the packets addressed to a specific device or on the values in the data payload. The advanced trigger capability on the 2 Series MSO, along with the protocol decode and search and mark capability, lets you capture and analyze complex events, giving you additional insights into your measurements.